People often ask, what are your favorite places in the world to visit? Unquestionably, Africa is number one. But to most people's surprise, Antarctica is number two. And uh, this is Antarctica. Antarctica is abundantly rich with life. And this one is, is just part of the spectacular scenery, the, the gorgeous, I love the gorgeous clouds coming in over the mountains. I love the, the yang and yin the, of the positive and negative of the snow and the patches in the mountains that you, that you get. It's not a chocolate box, classic pretty, pretty mountain. To me, it has a great deal of dignity. The weather there is often very unpredictable and, and can be stormy and dark and cloudy. I don't usually do dramatic skies. They're often a bit too obvious and sometimes can be too, too pretty. But I like this angry, dramatic sky. There are some penguins in the painting too. And the penguins are on the extreme right on the far shore, standing on that rocky slope that, that would undoubtedly be a penguin colony and give an idea of scale. There are only two parts of the world that I know of where you can stand in one place and look as far as the eye can see and see thousands of creatures, of, of animals, completely wild, completely not caring about you or anything to do with you, not in captivity. You used to be able to do that all over the world. Now there's only two places I know. One is the Serengeti during migration time and the other place is Antarctica. Um, and they're penguins, thousands of penguins in these penguin colonies. Close to a million I've seen at one look. You can't do that anyway. Well, you can see thousands of, of living things in Northern Ontario, but you call them mosquitoes and black flies. <laughs> now these, these are, <laughs> are warm-blooded, you know, good-sized living things. So Antarctica is wonderful. It's rich in bird life. It's rich in mammal life, whales, killer whales, uh, humpbacks, spectacular scenery. The mo it's, it's like the most spectacular parts of the Rocky Mountains and the Himalayas at sea level.